Three big reasons why men don't approach women anymore. You see hot girl walking down the street, your heart starts beating out of your chest, you overthink it, and she walks by. This approach anxiety is designed to protect you out of fear of getting rejected, okay? It's a normal thing. The thing you have to do is overcome it. Go out and get rejected as much as possible so that you're almost numb to it, so that you don't give a shit anymore. If you Number two is more of a serious concern. Some guys may think, am I going to be perceived as being a creep? Maybe word will get out that you went and approached a girl at work, you got rejected, and it can go so hard. Hot. Women talk. I don't advise guys to go up and approach girls in small close-knit community But if you're in the street who gives a shit? You're probably not gonna see that girl ever again They don't want anything to do with women anymore. They've thrown in the towel They're done trying to figure out women done playing the game They just think I have to be really jacked or I have to make a lot of money or else there's no point in even trying Yes, these things help. They're not everything which is why you need to constantly be working on every single aspect to be better. I'm sure you would see a world completely different from ours if you traveled back in time to 1950 in 2022 and looked at our world. In addition, this query has been on my mind for some time now. Why does that no longer approach women? Because outside today, you don't see it nearly as often as you did in the 1900s when you had no choice but to cold approach. I know that many of you won't remember this, but there was no cell phone, internet, or social media like we have today. In the past, if you wanted to get a woman, you had to physically approach her or go straight to her father, the church, or live close by, like in similar communities. It wasn't like you could just go online and meet women from the comfort of your own home and scratch your head. No, sir. Back then, getting a woman took a lot of effort, and women didn't have as many options or access to men around the world as they do today. She could choose from only the men in her community or the one guy who came to her small town and she met and fell in love with. Because of the lack of communication, men were more likely to approach a woman in those simpler times. He didn't know for sure if he would see her again. Therefore, he might have missed out on his future wife if he didn't take his chance. Is that not crazy? We are not required to do any of that in modern times. Even though almost everyone is connected and can be reached more easily, people are more disconnected than ever before to the point where they barely speak to each other. Also, men aren't approaching women anymore, and I think it's worth having a conversation about where everything went wrong and what this might mean for the future. So, why do men no longer approach women? One thing you need to know about men is that before making a decision, we need to think about the consequences and assess the risk. Take a look at how men approach marriage as evidence. The majority of men weigh the risks and benefits of making that commitment against the potential losses in the event of a divorce. Approaching women in the same way is the same thing. Men have simply decided that approaching women can risky and unsatisfying. To begin, men already feared women's rejection and humiliation. Therefore, the fact that a man continues to approach despite the risk of being rejected, ridiculed, or imprinted as a creep demonstrates that he believes the outcome will be worth it. But why would men want to approach a woman in a society where women view the typical men they don't want as predators and creeps? He would be humiliated more frequently by the average woman if he approached her to start a conversation. I've seen videos in which a man tries to talk to a woman without being rude or weird, and the woman just makes a fool of the man. For laughs and attention, the woman recorded the conversation and posted it to social media, spinning the story that he was a jerk. And as I sit here and watch that video, I wonder why I would ever want to approach a woman in this day and age. And to comprehend the reason for this, we must recognize that different men receive different treatment. I'll tell you what this means because I know you might be confused about that one. I want you to consider the status and how people's perceptions of value influence how they treat others. If you think back to times in your own life when you were approached by someone asking for money or by a homeless person whose clothes were dirty, you probably went on the defensive and did not speak with them or give them anything. The situation for women is the same, but it is much worse now than it was in the previous century. Because they run the risk of being taken by a man against their will at any time, women naturally need to exercise extra caution out in the world. 
However, the issue arises when you observe a woman speaking to a man in front of a large group of people, even though she is aware that she is protected to some extent. As a result, if we delve deeper, we can only begin to conclude that modern women do not respect men as a whole or the typical man. Because, returning to my discussion of status, if a woman is well known for disrespecting the average and below average men who approach her, do you believe she would do the same with Jeff Bezos' assistance? No, Jeff Bezos is a well-known billionaire with power, authority, and status. That woman would never dare humiliate or insult a man who is superior to her. As you can see at the end of the day, everything comes down to a man's status and value based on how he looks, talks, and interacts with the. As I mentioned earlier, a woman's behavior toward various men is influenced by her perception of that man. Additionally, she will treat the man as trash or inferior if she does not consider him superior to herself. On the other hand, if she believes that another man is superior to her, she will be more receptive to him and treat him with respect. Compare the way a woman and her boss interact with the janitor. Guess who would not be treated disrespectfully if they approached her, please? Therefore, I am stating all of this to help you comprehend that modern women have lost respect for men. And I believe that the majority of men have realized that and decided not to talk to these women. Men are choosing to leave relationships because they have witnessed how women treat other men who resemble them. Men are no longer going for that because they have realized that women's attitudes toward them are only getting worse. Men are realizing that approaching women is a bad experience that puts them at risk for their reputation and possibly their freedom. They'll be better off not talking to women, men are saying, so what? Because I'm not sure if you are aware that men have had the police called upon simply for approaching a woman who did not like them. Therefore, why on earth would men risk all of that and receive nothing in return most of the time? And this is where we are at right now. Men have to weigh the risks of approaching a woman and decide it's too risky and not worth it. Before the 1990s, women were not so out of place when a man wanted to talk to them. Because it's crazy. I don't approach. We can all agree, now that we have covered that point, the modern women's attitude toward men. Let's see if modern women even have the ability to be approached. If you don't come across as approachable, people will immediately decide not to even come near you or talk to you. Additionally, contemporary women appear to have something stuck in their rear end as they participate in society. I realize you need to encounter seeing a lady that you loved and how she made up her face, seeming to be ruler underhanded himself, made you not want to proceed to converse with that. Modern women have lost the ability to smile and appear friendly in public because almost all of them walk around with unapproachable expressions, which either repels men or turns them off. And all the best to you. I will not evaluate any of you. Just be aware that you are putting yourself in grave danger of being detained, humiliated and disrespected in public, and falsely accused of doing something you didn't do. It's a no as long as you still decide to do it despite knowing the risks. Men now have alternatives like sugar daddy websites and apps, which make it unnecessary for them to approach any random woman. Why would I take the chance of being rejected and humiliated in public? I can't understand it. Therefore, why in the world would I bother approaching women? Do you get my point? Because we don't have to approach women to get what we want. Men are no longer approaching women.